Hey guys, so this is vlog number two. Um, I got a lot of feedback from coworkers and my sister. She's so awesome. She uh, she does a lot. She watches a lot of vlogs and um, she gave me a lot of advice. You know, she the equipment, the hardware. You know, she gave me. And I love her for that. She's awesome. Um, but yesterday, so my wife watched the video and she did not appreciate um, what I said um, about our relationship. And basically, and I quote, she said, so yeah, and um, I decided to make a vlog and, you know, talk about us and our relationship a little bit, um, just to give you guys, you know, an idea behind me, behind us, and um, who we are and what we do, um, so yeah. Um, first of all, like I said, uh, we met in high school, uh, sophomore year, we had a lot of classes together, we were friends, um, she always said she was smarter than me, and I always said I was smarter than her, so we competed, you know, went back and forth, and, um, ultimately she got better grades, because I was lazy and I didn't do any homework, and so she was an AP student, and I was just, you know, trying to get by and graduate, so, um, you know, we... No, we did our own thing in high school. Like I said, we were friends, but we never really thought of each other as anything more. Um, after high school, uh, after graduation, uh, I went to a trip to California, and I was there for about five days hanging out. The whole time I was texting her, you know, from morning to night, and I would go to bed at like 2 in the morning, and she usually goes to bed around, you know, 10. Um, but she would stay up till about 2 and talk to me and text me and um, I would wake up, or when she would wake up, you know, at 7 in the morning, which is ridiculous for people to wake up at, but she would wake up early, and then she would text me, and, you know, we would, you know, text from there on, um, so the day I was coming back from California, uh, I was like, hey, you know what, is it cool if I stop by and hang out, and so she said, yeah, and I went over, we hung out, we, I think we watched some movies, and just, kind of just started going on from there, you know, we felt that spark, I guess, between us, and, um, here we are almost seven years later, um, you know, marriage for two and it's been a, it's been a wonderful, wonderful experience and she's, she's amazing. She is, um, you know, the cliche says she's my other half, but she really is. She kind of keeps me grounded and well, um, everything I do and it's because of her and, um, I'm very grateful. She, she, you know, she gives me advice. She's always there when I need her, and I think that she's the best, best blessing I've ever gotten, and I'm so grateful for her. Um, oh, she is just awesome. She currently works at a office. She works for a restoration company, and um, she likes it. I, from what I, she tells me, she likes it. And, you know, she's, she graduated from ASU and got her Justice Studies degree. And, you know, she's she's maybe waiting f to use it. She wants to get some more experience. And I totally support that. We got married in Sedona, Arizona, which is the most gorgeous, gorgeous place ever, I think. And um, if you guys have never been there, it's, it's just amazing. The scenery is gorgeous. And there's so much to do. There's hiking trails. Um, there's Jeep tours. You can rent Jeeps and go on the trails and just have a great time. And um, we got married in November, so the leaves were just turning, and it was just the perfect weather. It was it was an amazing, an amazing wedding. And if I can go back and do it all over again, I would. And um, our families, you know, they're like, you know what? That's the best wedding we've ever been to. And it, and it's awesome to hear that, just because we put so much time and effort into it. And um, I'm really grateful that we could do something like that to honor, you know, what we joined and um, start a family. Um, we don't have any kids. Um, we actually had a miscarriage um, back in June, and it was it still is one of the hardest things that we have to deal with. But um, you know, we're we're getting we're getting by. I think that. Um, we're at a point now where it's easier, but sometimes it's harder, especially now. Um, our due date was January 3rd, so it's getting it's getting rough. Um, ne these next couple days, I think, next couple weeks will be hard on both of us just because, um, 
you know, we're expecting this baby and um, now it's just, you know, it's something that we got to, I guess, you know, help each other through it and um, come out the other side, you know. Uh, it's one of those things that I always tell her, you know, God knows why he does things and the way he does. And so I think in time, in time, we have two puppies and, um, well, they're not really puppies, but to her they are. Um, we have a lab pit bull mix. She is three. And she, poor thing just got spayed, so she's having a little trouble with that. We had to actually go to the vet today and get a checkup on her because she's, um, she's not doing so well. And then um, we have a seven-year-old. I'm not sure what he is. We've never really got a clear answer. Uh, we adopted him. Uh, he is a maybe like a bull terrier pit bull mix we're not too sure we want to get dna tests and see what what they are and just so we can confirm um what else guys um i don't know i think that's it's pretty much a sum of it um i know i left a lot of details out but hey if you guys want to hear something if you guys have any questions let me know and you know i'll be glad to answer them um but yeah, so thank you for watching, and I'm so excited because I have 24 views, and I have two subscribers, and four thumbs up, and the matter of, you know, 24 hours, so that's just like, so exciting for me. Um, keep, keep watching, guys, and uh, again, give me feedback, you know, questions, help me out here, guys. Um, but yeah, so see you guys later, vlog number three. <laughs>